I love the direction we're heading in our kitchen this it's morning ridiculous. with Cindy Ross. I forgot. I didn't know my mic was on just then. She was saying that she likes to see me cook in the kitchen, and I was telling her that it's ridiculous. Um, mainly, I just see when you have things laying out and something in the pan, I, I like, like to I look. to mix it. Yeah, I like to look like I know what I'm doing. Um, so you and I were talking about what we're making today, quinoa. Yes. Right. Good. Okay, but I see it in the store, and when you see it in the store, Joa, get a shot of this, of the name. When y'all see this in the store, do, I mean, it doesn't sound like how it's pronounced. That doesn't, to me, that doesn't sound no, like quinoa to me. It doesn't. It doesn't. So I see it in the store, and I'm like, let's pronounce that. <laughs> You know, um, but you're here to educate me oh. on this. And I was talking about trying new things. Quinoa, lentils would be another one that I'd like to try. So for those who've never had it and they've seen it in the store and they don't know how to pronounce it as well, tell everybody what it is. Well, it's a grain, but it's so easy to make too. I mean, literally, we're going to make a, a one pan dish and it's going to be 20 minutes and that's it. I mean, my prep time was about five minutes slicing up everything. Okay. Um, I'm using organic uh, black beans corn and just really um, petite diced tomatoes and actually they, they have a little spice to them mm, so okay. so you're gonna like it. Um, we're using some cilantro garlic of course jalapeno and um, that's just kind of been sitting there on medium um, and then we're gonna dump in our quinoa and some vegetable um, you can use vegetable broth or stock. Oh okay yeah. good to so, know. Um, so it's, it's super easy again and it's and you know, it's a good grain and it's gluten free and it's just good for us. And it's one of those things uh, that you could mix in whatever you like. Like mm -hmm. if you didn't like corn or if you didn't like uh, something, you could mix different things in there. Yeah, I mean at home we use like ground turkey and yeah. we kind of just throw like whatever is left over in because it, again it, it's a great carbohydrate and um, it's actually a little bit higher in carbs but it's a good carbohydrate and so it's, it's going to give you long lasting energy. Oh good, so uh, we're going to get going on this but first real quick, you did an interview yesterday with us talking about gym memberships. Mm -hmm. Tell everybody what you talked about. Well, well, you know, it's the new year, mm -hmm. and, and the whole subject was about, you know, keeping the New Year's resolutions where we're seeing a flood of new people coming in. Yeah. And we are, you know, it actually started probably about a week before Christmas, and I started seeing some web submissions coming in, and that's just people inquiring about the gym. And then between Christmas and New Year's, you see a big push because mm -hmm. I think, you know, people are feeling like so guilty after mm -hmm. they've had those high calorie yeah. meals and they're wanting to start a change. And, you know, we're a little bit different because we're a more intimate atmosphere than your big box gym so we're going to keep you accountable so for those people that have a hard time staying on those new year's resolutions we got the answers and we're going to keep you on track and we're going to call we're going to i was going to say cindy will be like hey what you doing Hello. today you want to come to the gym <laughs> you know we might like see you at the grocery store and hunt yeah. you down check yeah. what's in your grocery cart it's yeah. what we do <laughs> well good so yeah if they're interested someone watching today you are interested in a new gym membership go check out bodies by cindy the classes are wonderful it's one of the best things i like about your gym thanks yeah they they're super popular and especially during this time of year and you know again the members keep you accountable as yeah. well because it does become a family oriented atmosphere when you become a member. Very good well yeah if you want to see her about the gym you can if you want to continue to watch here which we hope you do we're going to get going on this dish quinoa. Wait did I say it right? Quinoa. Quinoa. You got it. Sometimes I just mix up the you letters got it. Joe. Quinoa, <laughs> quinoa. Keen. Like, quinoa. like you have a keen eyesight. I like keen, that. Quinoa. I like that you're associating things. That helps me. Not like your next of kin. Quinoa. Keen. 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 <laughs>